Hey, hey, it's no. Oh, I, I didn't like capture any of the actual day. Hey, but we were not at the Nintendo Switch road trip. Lucky, get out of the video. Uh, so, oh, we're gonna, you're gonna uh, want to look at Lucky Norris if you want the footage of the day. But this is uh, me uh, doing something after on our way to the car. Uh-huh. Yeah. Alright, and... And... Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Hi. I am Lucky Norris. Follow my YouTube channel. You mean the crowd? Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. As you can see, Pokemon Sword Shield. Uh-huh. Yeah. Okay. And... And... Thank you, thank you for uh, Nintendo for having this event, and it got me to try games I never tried before. Uh, uh, and not just that, that including the retro arcade with N sixty four, NES, SNES, S, GameCube, a Turp they had one Turbo Graphics sixteen, a twenty six hundred, and an Atari Jaguar are there. Yeah. yeah, all those consoles. Are... Yeah. yeah. And it got me to try games I've never thought I would try before. Like Super Smash like... Bros. Melee, Duck Hunt, Hunt uh, Castlevania, uh, that's uh, Super uh, uh, Contra, uh, and a couple others. And also, oh, it was my first time touching a GameCube and SNES controller. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, they also had the NES Classic. We SNES Classic. Oh, they also had a PlayStation and uh, the PlayStation had a Classic. Famicom too, Kyle. Yeah, they had a Super <laughs> Famicom. Yeah. Um, but the weird thing is, they didn't have the Famicom AV okay, or the Family Computer Disk System, but. But that, those two, the Family Disk System might be a like little. They're, I think they're maybe too oh, expensive. The third in the pan only. Yeah. And like the English version, the NES top loader, yeah, that didn't have AV. Yeah. No. This is Lucky Block 98 signing off. Uh -huh. And this is, this might be your personal ending, yeah. Yeah. At least uh, for your video. Okay. So, anyway.